So I have created these two services, SV app hyphen SVC and app tool hyphen SVC. Let's see whether they work or not using NSLOOKUP. Now you had seen in the previous one also that it was giving error and it is saying that server cannot find app hyphen SVC dot prod dot SVC cluster dot local fail. This is the error that we are getting. Now why we are having this even though after creating the service, we should be able to see the service when you do a NS lookup, we should be able to get the cluster IP, but we are not. The reason here is that if you take a look at this server, it is looking up 127.0.0.53. Seems like that the name server that it is looking is this one 127.0.0.53. But our name server should have these two IP addresses 10.32.0.2 and 10.32.0.3 because these two IP addresses belong to the core DNS. So to make sure that the services work, what we have to do is that we have to edit the hcresolve.con file in the master server. If you see here, the name server is 127.0.0.53, but this, this should not be our name server. 10.32.0.2 should be the one. And you can add multiple name servers like this. The other one is 10. 3203 and then save it and now if we do a ns lookup i should be able to see the ip address which is 10 10103147102 and similarly i should be able to see the ip address of the other service also which is 10991091213 which are nothing but the cluster ip address of these two services now this is how you solve the problem of service resolution if you note here, I'm using this different machine. I'm not using the compute engine. So for your case, when you try, the IP address might be something else instead of 127.0.0.53. I think it'll be 169.254, 169.254. If you are using a Red Hat machine in Google Compute Engine instance. But the solution is same, no matter what operating system you use. You get the IP address of core DNS, which are this one 10.32.0.2 and 10.32.0.3 or else I could have used the I cluster IP address of the service also which is 10.96.0.10 I could have mentioned this one as well so any one is fine so if you are using the service cluster IP address of QBNS service then you have to mention only 10.96.0.10 in hcresolve.com as I said I forgot to provide the resolution so I'm using it in an Ubuntu machine long after this service section. Uh, sorry about that but uh, the resolution will be same for any operating system. And it is a best practice to mention the cluster IP address of the service rather than individual pod IP address. The way I have done it you should not do it you should always use the cluster IP address of the cube DNS service as shown here.